All right, y'all got it? We'll see what bunk beds look like when we come back. Welcome to my life, welcome to my life, yeah. On the bright side, yeah, this music here became my only lifeline. Think I'm going crazy, I'm not in my right mind. Welcome to my life, welcome to my life, yeah. Welcome to my life, welcome to my life, yeah. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and it is another day. We're still in Alabama. Lois Ann's with us today. We got the whole family. You even got Cam with us on the farm today. We're going to try to get some work done. Um, maybe a little bit in the house, as you saw from the previous vlog and you know the, from some previous video. But we're also going to try to get some stuff done in the barn and actually have a first night to sleep in the barn tonight. At least that's the game plan. All right, well, we just got here. We're going to grab some food and then figure out a game plan for what we need to get done today. So we'll be back in just a minute. But before I go, don't forget, subscribe to the channel, guys. Hit that big thumbs up. Like the video. Share it, if you will. And make sure you turn those notifications on, guys. We really appreciate it. All right, we'll be back in a minute. What's up, farm dog? You having a good time? Like this big. Yeah. Where's Micah? Micah's still over there. I came over here to get a fishing pole. Micah's hogging it. Well, I'm fine, you know. Did y'all catch anything? Uh, he didn't, no. They didn't. Because they're, they're using like tadpoles. Yeah. And they ran out of tadpoles. Alright, update on our uh, progress. Cam's enjoying life. Took the countertops off. Had to cut holes to line up the pipe, so still kind of working on that. Getting the cabinets all lined up, and uh, the boys have been trying to scrub the floor where there was some overspray of paint when I painted before. So I'd have to do a little elbow grease work scrubbing in here. We well, can see kind of the paint where the uh, tarp, tarp blew up. Gavin's doing a good job in this room. Look, I helped you out, Gavin. I did a little bit of that for you. That was the hardest side of the world. I got some of that for you. So, Gavin, scrubbing away. That a boy, Gav. Putting some work in. Just trying to get the floor all cleaned up. You can see it's still dirty. Again, we got some paint stuff. Yeah, and that's, that's about the amount of work that one's been doing. No. The other ones are working pretty good. I've been doing work because my shoulder hurts. No. So yeah, scrubbing the paint, getting the paint up, getting the floor. I bet you can't even tell. All cleaned up so we can move some stuff in and get our beds in here and spend the night tonight. It's the game plan. All right. Time to get back to it, Cam. Giving Cam a jalapeno chip. See his up. reaction. No, no, not up, up, sit. Pop, pop, spin. No, oh. you didn't do it. Why are you giving him a big one? Can you spicy? So you bring it on. All right, little update. Uh, the boys have done a pretty good job cleaning the floor, mopping, taking a little dinner break, a little snack break, but the floors look a lot better. Uh, still a few little dirty spots and um, little little paint spots here and there that we've got to go back and get, but you can tell the floor looks a million times better. So they've done a good job. Dodie and I <laughs> have been on this project. So I didn't realize it at the time, but I wound up buying this sink. It could go either way. It could either be an under the counter mount or on top. Well, I really like the under the counter mount, so we did that. So I had the, the butcher block top cut for that. However, this cabinet was not prepared that way, and I did not realize it, did not think about it until now. So we have been making little templates, and they have been a project. Cutting these little templates out to mount down in here to hold the sink so that it can sit down inside so the counter can sit on top and sit flush. So we have been cutting 
and making those little supports. Now we've got to measure it out and get it just right so we can do that. Uh, LA made a long trip to the store to get some of our necessary supplies and uh, she's out. Spraying the weeds. In the dark. But it's going to rain tomorrow so it needs to be done tonight. Spraying weeds. Good job LA. You can see our weeds here have uh, kind of taken over in our little gravel section. Oh, you can't really see it. It was a full moon earlier. All right, these boys are in charge of putting up a bunk. We're completely fine. Gavin's making it sound worse. You see a ratchet wrench or the right bit. Yeah. Don't need any help. Well, for one, you got to lift this up and hit it. Whoa, Why'd you kick heck? it? Well, you can't. Ha you have to have it level. Whoa. I didn't kick it. This door had. Look, hold that door, Gavin. Hold it up. It's got to be level. Yeah, yeah, you can't screw it in at a crooked at an angle. I know, I know, but like we were fine, and then um, we couldn't get the top screw in. Here, yeah. What the, oh, why'd you? Oh, you yeah. And you have the washer in. Yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa! It's about to fall. I know, I'm holding it. Mm -hmm. okay, but that's why I said three of you. One of you hold this, right? It's fine. No, Dad, we're not holding it right now. We need to try and fix. Look good, Dad. Well, here's the the things that hold the screws in right here. Someone yeah, we before. need this one. Like it's messed up. It's you lost that out of me? No, no we didn't lose it. It's in you got it turned crooked. No, it was already turned crooked. You can't get. Because that little thing gadget right here is what the screw goes in. Do you understand how it works? Yeah. Because that's what the screw. Yeah, that's the. It was like that, but it wasn't working. All right, y'all got it? Yeah. Cause I gotta go back and work on the sink some more. All right. We'll see what bunk beds look like when we come back. All right, I'm fine. Well, I was out here cutting a little more depth on my little bracket for the sink. And of course it snapped. So now I've got to rip a new piece, cut out the little jigs. Ah, the frustrations continue. Alright, oh, looky there. It looks like it's together. Well, at least one board. Yeah. Good job. Where's the next one? Yeah. So then you gotta get the uh, Another bottom and the top ones. Good job, dudes. Let's go see what LA's working on. Ooh, hanging curtains. Yeah, good job, well, LA. Well, we didn't have an iron here, so next time we come, we'll have to bring a steamer and steam them. Yeah, yeah that's nice. Yeah, I thought so. What do you think, Cam? Huh? What do you think, Poppy? All right, well, nice job, LA. I actually think I'm going to go to the house at home. They're blackout. So now yeah. I'm going to attempt this mattress in a box. Wow, check it out. Mattress in a box. Never had one, never tried one, but it got a what star rating? Four and a half. Four and a half star. That's a king Four size. That's right. $259, I think. Right. So we'll see. Not that we wanted a king in here, but we had two box springs that we can push together, which makes a king. So that was cheaper to buy just a king size mattress and to go get a queen, queen and, and have springs. to buy that box spring. So we were trying to eliminate some costs. Next time you go on me, I'm going to be asleep in here. Yeah, LA's ready to go to bed. It's 10.30 our time. Late night. Late night, puppy. You're gonna sleep good, don't you? Yeah, you've been having a hectic day. Oh, you've been a farm dog. You've been a farm dog. You went down to the pond where the boy is fishing, found some ticks on him, got the ticks off. You a full-fledged farm dog. All right, what's everybody up to now? Yes. Got some makeshift lines up. Yeah, move the stuff. Like the sunlight coming in. Yeah. 
I can't. And our support boards, we had to cut some more boards to make sure we get it good and supported. Yeah, I'm done with my drill, I need it. Yeah, we're done. All right, it's 10.30. Dodie and I finally got our brackets on, even though I had to cut a new one because I split that one. Well, the new ones worked out, and I think I've got it perfectly level. And you can see that sucker is flush. So, now that I got the sink dropped in, oh yeah, it looks good. And it's flush across and it's level. Uh, that was a huge project. It's done. So now we'll get the counters back in, get them lined up perfectly on here. And then we'll put the countertop back on. Hopefully the countertop, the holes are already been cut in it. I, I think we've got it lined up, but we won't really know until we actually put the countertop on top. And then we will see. Let's see <laughs> All right, we got the bed in here. We got the bed frames in, the box springs. It was pretty good. And Lace testing out the new mattress. Yep, it's it, good. Feels good? Mm -hmm. Curtains get up. these dirty jeans off yeah. my bed. Let's come across. Colin wants to check his room. Check Colin's. Ooh, I like the double bunks. Gavin's gonna go up top. I think he wants Cam to sleep with him up there. Watch this, watch this. You sleep right there. Oh, Cam got his bed right there. Yep. I think Mike's well, already I'm out. I won't let him go anywhere. We won't, anywhere else. We'll finish putting up uh, the rest of the bunk tomorrow. We didn't really need it tonight, so mm -hmm. they stopped. Cam has got his bed between the boys. I'm gonna work more. Although he's like, what's going on? I'm not ready to go to sleep yet. I know where to go sleep. Yeah, don't worry, I'm not either. Like Alright, good job boys. You did good and the floors are looking good. Like I said, there's the rest of the rails for the bunk. Floors are looking still pretty good. I think it's still dusty up top. We'll have to clean that maybe tomorrow. Alright, buddy, let's uh let's put our countertop on. Let's do it. Let's do it. You still up for helping us, Gavin? Yeah. Alright. Can't, can't go to sleep. Can't go to sleep. Too excited. All right, we got the counter on, and man, it fits perfect. We got everything lined up perfect. Our sinkhole for our faucet. God, looks so good with the drop-in under mount sink. Ooh, looks nice. So now we've got to seal it. I want to probably get one coat of uh one cut of oil um to help seal the uh the butcher block top get a cut on tonight so we can get a cut on tomorrow because tomorrow's our last day here before we have to head back to um, tuscaloosa tomorrow night and then back to florida after that so i need to get at least two coats on so we'll get one on tonight see what it looks like doing a good job g all right well it's late i'm gonna try to Talk softly. Cam's still awake. It's almost midnight. Finished sealing the butcher block top so you can see how much darker it is with the oil. So I'll let that absorb overnight. Put another coat on in the morning. Check on the boys. So and getting the Shop's getting cleaned up a little bit more now that we moved some stuff out of the way. But so I sealed, or at least got one coat of the uh, the oil sealing that butcher block top as well, and that was freshly painted. So we haven't moved that in yet. Do that tomorrow. Got plenty other projects for tomorrow. I'm exhausted. I'm going to bed. So we will catch you guys in the morning, and I'll be back in just a minute. But good night for now. All right, well, it's a new morning at the farm. The first night went pretty good. I think uh, I was just, my mind was racing, so I didn't sleep great, but uh, it was fun being out here and spending the night. Unfortunately, it got a rainy morning, so that's limiting some of the stuff that we we're gonna do today. So we've just been kind of cleaning up some of the shops, some of the barn. Gavin's been itching to go spray some wasp nests that we saw yesterday, so he's He's about to spray a wasp nest. Let's see how this goes. What are you aiming at? That's good. Oh, 
Here, go. Let me go get that one. Stop. I'm good in it. A pile of old sheet rock. <clears throat> so the boys have been cleaned up. This area right in through here, right here. Uh, I'm putting a wash, a, uh, a wash sink here. And then this is where a hot water tank, although this was when we were gonna originally do a big hot water tank, but then I started looking around and I think I'm gonna do one of those tankless hot water tanks. Um, but anyways, we're just trying to clean up a little bit. So that's the morning. All right, next project. Micah has one, and Kyler has one, like a little sink, wash tubs, utility tubs, one for the shop out here, and then one will be inside in the laundry area. See if they can figure it out. It's not hard. Wait, that's, that's no cheating, Kyler. I'm not, what? <laughs> you just see you peeking. Do it off. I need a hammer. Give me that rubber hammer. You don't need a hammer. The rubber mallet. Yeah, the rubber mallet. I need a drum. This is crap. <laughs> All right, legs are on. Now they got to figure out the next part. This leg is not good. I want to hammer it. Can I? Oh. Put a board on it. This is easy. So Where's the board, Dad? Simple math Come, where's the wood that you need? This is the greatest one. No cheating, cheating. What do you mean cheating, cheating? Read the instructions, Buster. I want to read. Hey! Okay. I'll let it pop up and hit you. Try to hold the board. Smarty. All right, while the boys are working on that project, Dodie and I are going to seal the countertop. We have, you know, we've already put oil uh, to seal the actual wood part, but now I've got to put a watertight seal between the countertop and the sink, obviously to make it waterproof. Lois Ann has been working on curtains. Yeah. Yay, yay. Look, wow, we got some curtains up, looking good. All right, so now on to this project. Okay, I am coming to check on the boys' progress. Micah is destroying card, as you can see. Oh, that's pretty nice. It's not really a race, Kevin, but if it was a race, you'd be losing pretty badly. <laughs> Y'all are doing a good job. Where do these go? I know one goes right inside on the laundry room, and one comes one goes right, right out there. here. Hand okay. yeah, I see sink. That. Good job, Kyla. <laughs> Wrong. <laughs> All right, guys, we got 30 minutes and what? then to leave. Yeah, you can. I might have to do it for you, but it'll get done. We can do it. It's like halfway. Gavin, let's see you and I start cleaning up in the other room. No, you and I are going to pop How do I attach this? We're going to do what? Pop these bubbles. No, we're not. We need to find your clothes. Like a, uh, what? Tell me how to attach this. Stop. You don't remember. Yes, I do. How? Well, do you guys have instructions? Let me do it. Yeah. Colin, let, Colin, let me do it. And then instructions. Colin, let me do it. No. Yes. No. Yes. Are you sure it's not in the instructions? If Colin would let me do it, you I don't. Can't okay, be done. do it then. Okay, give me it. No, you don't need this. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes, you do. Does it twist in? Yes. No, it doesn't. Oh, yeah, it does. It twists in. But I'm pretty sure it's wrong. Right. Righty tighty. It's going the wrong no, way. No, not that. What do you mean? I'm talking. Th yeah, you put it in backwards. No, I put it in right. You didn't. God, it's right. Go, you got it. I 
You keep it like that. There you go. Boom! Gavin knows how to do stuff. Yeah. Oh, Gavin! Stop! He said I could not do it. But I did it. Good job, G. I had to pop all these bubbles. No, I want you to go find your shirt and your I know socks and go put them on. They're in my room. Michael, where are those? I think they're in my where room. Where are these? Oh, I can't find them. My socks are right. Thank you. Colin. What? The pipes are right here. What pipes? This. These big ones. They're right there. Oh. All right, good work, boys. All right, well, our time has come to an end at the farm, but we made a lot of progress this trip on the actual barn. Unfortunately, not a whole lot in the house. Gotta wait for them to move a lot of their crap out and before we really can get in there and cleaning and start renovating that. But um, we did start taking some of the steps necessary to, the sewer was messed up, sewage issues, so we're getting that taken care of, yard. Uh, securing it so we got some of those things in the process but couldn't actually physically get in there and do a lot of renovating just yet because of some of the stuff but like I said good progress on the barn it's still look there's still a lot of junk I know man we actually have a good bit moved out thankfully the boys did finally finish the, uh, the wash tubs come in and it's of course, the floors need mopped and cleaned again, but it's just kind of part of it. We're just constantly in and out with the rain and stuff. Curtains up. Bam, look how good the kitchen looks. Butcher block tops, all sealed. Got this seal, although I do need to still run another bead uh, to waterproof around the edges, but got the new faucet in, it looks good. There's our other little countertop. The master, you know, nothing special, just where we had the bed. And then, we didn't really do much in the loft this time, other than just kind of clean a little bit. Got their curtains up, but they have their double beds in here. That's it, that's a wrap at the farm. Uh, we head back to Tuscaloosa now. We'll get up early in the morning, head back to Florida. Guys, we appreciate you following along on our journey. Hope you're enjoying this. Have a good one. Bye-bye. Welcome to my life. Welcome to my life, yeah. Welcome to my life. Welcome to my life, yeah.